I don't think I've had the chance to tell you this, but I actually see a lot of potential in you. In fact, you kind of remind me of myself. Highly athletic, super likable, intercontinental champion, well, former in my case. You just need that extra push to get you to the next level. Thanks? No problem. And in fact, since we're so compatible, I think I could actually help you make that leap. So what do you say? I wasn't really looking for help, but I guess I'm willing to give it a shot. Great. From now on, I'll be at ringside for all your matches to assist you as needed. Okay, but I really just want you out there in a coach type role. Nothing hands on, if you know what I mean. Of course, say no more. Totally understand. I really feel like this is the start of something special. See you out there. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. This is going to be good. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. The WWE Universe more than ready for this title defense, and the champion is prepared, too. Chad Gable, big opportunity here tonight. <laughs> Chad may be the greatest coach of all time. Look what he did to Otis. Yeah, but is Chad Gable actually teaching the right lessons? Look at the record book, Saxton. You see all those W's? Those look like the right lessons to me. Great tag team partner, great mentor, great single star. Chad Gable has not only resurrected his career, but Otis's as well. And Gable does it all for the Academy. Introducing the challenger from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable! And introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas. Weighing in at 272 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. Tonight continues the tradition of the highly coveted Intercontinental Championship. Its holder is frequently considered by many as the hardest working champion in all of sports entertainment. Tonight, the WWE Universe gets its first glimpse of what could be a powerful new alliance on SmackDown between the Intercontinental Champion and his new mentor of sorts, Sami Zayn. 
With Sammy watching at ringside, the Intercontinental Champion defends his title against the always dangerous Chad Gable. The Intercontinental Champ clearly has his eyes set on the future, but he'll be in serious trouble if he overlooks Gable here tonight. DDT! Spike them. Gable on the receiving end. Kick to the midsection, sunset flip. Whoa, round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. The challenger's looking shaken. Uh oh, way too oh, God, moon salt. Oh my God, moon salt. Consecutive high risk maneuvers and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. Can Gable withstand much more of this? Gable has to gather the energy to turn the tables. Set crashing to the floor. And countouts are legal, so hopefully, this will be a short trip outside. He's returning fire. But he still has more work to do to get this fully in his favor. Okay, he's re-entering the rank. Holy! Face first with a waistlock takedown. Big forearm. Catches the leg. Spectacular athleticism.
Gutierrez. I can't imagine a world in which they're not proud of that win. Chad went from ready, willing, and gable to ready, willing, and beaten. Seeing you up close made me realize just how special you really are. Yeah, that was a nice win. But what was up with you breaking up that pin? I thought we had an agreement that you were just out there to observe. Nothing hands-on. That was blatant cheating. Whoa, whoa, no need to throw around the C word like that. Look, I only did what I did as a last resort. You were going to lose your Intercontinental Championship. And besides, you would have done the exact same thing. We're pretty much the same person, remember? I'm starting to have my doubts about that. And what you did wasn't necessary. I was going to kick out. We can go back and watch a tape. I'm not so sure you had things under control. Yeah, well, I'm not so sure I can trust you. Where is this coming from? You won the match and you're still champion. We have a good thing going. Don't ruin it. And I promise I have nothing but the best intentions for you. I don't know. Look, I have an idea how we can erase your doubts and help strengthen our bond a bit. Next week, we're going to team up together. Okay, sound good? Yeah, sounds good. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 484 pounds. The enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. And Sami Zayn! This former indie competitor developed a cult fan following in the United States as videos of his matches started to get talked about. Thanks to social media, those fans are still with him as he builds the foundation of his career. The Alpha Academy is open for business. We are about to see a clinic. And their opponents first, representing the Alpha Academy from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable. Minnesota native has scratched and clawed for everything he's earned in his life. Represented the United States in the Olympics, former tag team champion on multiple occasions. Chad Gable is ready to do big things on the big stage. The modern day Maharaja. And from Punjab, India, weighing in at 238 pounds, Jinder. Oh Let's just say with my status, I have been gifted access to Jinder Mahal that not just any schlub off the street can get, Byron. I know about the strategy of Jinder Mahal. I have spent time enjoying mindfulness with the modern-day Maharaja. We see Jinder's in peak physical condition. Mentally, Jinder is even stronger right now. He is clear, he is ready for battle, and ready to proudly represent the entire nation of India. And this tag team match is sure to be filled with exciting action. These teams want the win bad tonight, and they'll fight hard to get it. Yeah, these superstars look like they're all business, not a weak link among them. And what a reversal from Chad Gable. Going right after the neck, neckbreaker. He's in off the tag. Yeah. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. And finds a counter. Back and 
forth from these competitors. Round and around we go. Tilt the world head scissors. Oh my God! A DDT spike them. Kick to the midsection. Sunset flip. Into a power bomb. Now he's been put on the defensive. Jinder's locked up. Face plant. Round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. And Mahal's in a disheartening spot. But the Maharaja's always just one move away from changing everything. Plan to the T. Oh, from behind. Ah. Oh, wow. Frankensteiner. Nice. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, are you are you kidding, kidding me? The back of his neck. He's looking shaky at best now. And he has just taken an extraordinary amount of abuse. Jinder knows about changing paths in his career. Now he needs to change paths in this match. That took athleticism. Jinder's hopes are wavering. Jinder has a storm to weather here. Oh, from behind. Oh, wow. Frankensteiner. Nice. It's always disorienting taking those hits above the shoulders. This is troublesome from the hall. Tagged in. to victory really putting the sports in another huge win see what did i tell you from the beginning when we're working together no one can stop us that was definitely a nice win but there was one thing that bothered me here we go again now what well it just seemed like you're insisting on getting the win out there it just made me think, like, maybe this isn't so much about helping me as it is about advancing your own career. Maybe I got caught up in the moment, but it's a tag team match. Emphasis on team. It doesn't matter who wins as long as we win, right? Yeah, no, you're right, I guess. Anyway, enough about that. I've got something super cool lined up for you next week. Part of you reaching the next level is being able to beat opponents you're not familiar with. So that's why I got this mask guy, El Ordinario, coming in to face you. He can really go from what I've heard, so make sure you bring your A-game. Okay, sounds interesting. I will. Oh, and there's one other thing. I, I can't believe I almost forgot to tell you this. I'm actually getting my wisdom teeth out next week, so I won't be out there in your corner. You'll have to face Ordinario on your own, but don't worry, you'll be fine. Sure, right. This isn't weird at all. Weird? It's a totally normal sequence of events. You got this.
Intercontinental Championship. Big match here, guys, as the title will be on the line tonight. And the champ has looked dominant of late, but all it takes is one wrong move, and that title could be going home with somebody else. The man, the myth, the mystery, El Ordinario. Ladies and gentlemen, as a reminder, the championship is on the line here tonight. And in looking at the opposition, I can say that the champion will have quite the hill to climb in this one. El Ordinario will need to be anything but ordinary to win this match tonight. Introducing the challenger from Long Beach, California, weighing in at 202 pounds, El Ordinario. And introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 272 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. Who's going to lay claim to the workhorse title here tonight? Michael, because there are rumors buzzing throughout the WWE Universe that the face under the mask might not be so fresh at all. It does seem like an odd time for Sammy to get his wisdom teeth out, but who are we to question the wisdom of a veteran superstar like Sami Zayn? And again. Avoiding contact. Kick to the midsection, sunset flip. I think we're gonna see it! Wait a minute, is that Sami Zayn? Well, now I'm very confused. Uh, who's under the mask? It's El Ordinario. I told you not to question Sami Zayn's honesty, Saxton. Oh, over 
and connects. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. He planned for this and could still rally. From behind, German suplex. Face first, here it comes. Hold on. There's the sling blade. Basement drop kick. Headed to the top now. From the heavens, big body splash from the top. Pulls the rip cord, knee strike to the face. Here's a pin for the title. One, two, and the title still up for grabs. Somehow, some way. El Ordinario slowly rising to what may be his demise. Continental Champion! No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt-kicking. With a win like this, things have got to taste a little bittersweet right about now. Actually, Saxton, I imagine the win tastes a lot more like pennies. Thanks. But I thought you weren't going to be here this week. What happened with your wisdom teeth? Oh, I actually recovered much quicker than I thought I would, and decided last minute to come support you. I barely made it in time, which is why I came out in the middle of the match. I know you haven't approved of all my methods, so I hope that was okay. No, it was. And if we're being honest, I actually have something to tell you. I kind of thought maybe this whole thing with the unknown opponent and your wisdom teeth seemed a little shady. And this is crazy, but I thought you were going to be under the mask. Oh. Really? It just got me thinking that this was all some big scheme to try to take my intercontinental title, and now I feel terrible. I never really gave you a fair chance. No, no, it's okay, and don't feel bad. I've definitely done some shady things before, so I can see why you'd think all that. Sorry. Stop, it's okay. Let's just get past this, all right? I'll be back in your corner next week, and we'll pretend like nothing ever happened. You've got enough to worry about with defending your title, and you don't need any other distractions. Okay, thanks. You're right. Sounds good. Ladies and gentlemen, Elias. Hello, I am Elias. And as the man who holds the power of the wind in his fist, I've got one question for everybody here tonight. Who wants to walk with Elias? Now, I have been all across the world. I've been to Paris, I've been to Italy, all across Europe, South America, South Africa, you name it, Elias has been there and it has brought me here tonight. And it seems everywhere I go, no matter what I do, a universal truth follows me. And I am certain that everyone here knows it. It is that WWE stands for... I said WWE stands for... Hey. Well, I gotta tell you, I certainly came prepared with a song tonight, but before I get started, I need you all to do a few things for me. I need you to silence your cell phones, hold your applause, and shut your mouths! Uh. 
I'm waiting for a town that's not such a disgrace But I see so many stupid people I wanna punch them in the face I'm waiting for a town that's not such a disgrace But I see so many stupid people I want to punch them in the face Graves, are you ready to walk with Elias? Negative, Ghost Rider. He's got his own album, Corey. How can you deny what this man is all about? In the ring, bell to bell, absolutely. I've got all the respect in the world for what Elias is capable of. But when he strums his guitar, it makes my ears bleed. I'd actually kind of like to see that. I'm so excited. I can tell. Introducing the challenger from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 222 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, Elias. And introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 272 pounds. He is the WWE Intercontinental Champion. The Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. The Intercontinental Championship, one of the most coveted titles in all of WWE. The Intercontinental Championship held by over a dozen WWE Hall of Famers, the likes of Stone Cold Steve Austin, Shawn Michaels, Bret Hart, well, that title symbolizes the world course of WWE. It certainly has a history of being the largest stepping stone any individual can climb. Known to put superstars on the map. All facts that these men know very well. Big forearm. And he said, you're going to get me with that this time. He went right into that turnbuckle. Elias gets intercepted. Face first. Oh, target in the arm. This has got to hurt. Yeah, Elias needs to figure things out quick. Paying it right back with a reversal. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. It's Mark. Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Oh, man. Good three. Turn your lights out. Oh, putting focus on the arm here. Oh, and a layout DDT. Producing a trampling. Elias moves out of the way. The challenger is not in a great place. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Reversal on top of reversal. And he's locked him up. Oh, God, face first. And he is now in a discouraging spot. In this situation, he has to get resourceful. Enough already. And Elias reverses it. Elias finding an answer for that burst of attacks against him. No! Set time! Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. Uh-oh. Another one bites the dust to the champ. Three. We'll slide back in the ring now. Elbow. And Elias' 
is on the downside of things right now. Yeah, Elias needs from the middle rope. Oh, a splash! The challenger being outclassed here. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. This is in a bad spot here, guys, but we all know how quickly he can change his suit. He just can't hold one. Knee strike to the face. Climbing the turnbuckle now. Successful title defense for the Intercontinental Champion. Yeah, I have to give credit to Sami Zayn. It's no coincidence the IC champ has been on a roll since he aligned with Sami. Why should I be a good person and try to help you if you won't even give me and everyone else thinks I am? A shady liar, a cheat, and the man who is going to take your title. Wow. In a matter of seconds, everything just changed for the Intercontinental Champion. Did I say the champion was on a roll with Sammy? Yeah, I meant collision course. The Intercontinental Championship is always hotly contested, but competition has never been this intense. Winning this prestigious title puts you in the same breath as many WWE Hall of Famers. Well, the conspiracy theorist himself has now joined us. Although... You should be excited about that, Byron. One of the greatest minds this industry has ever known. Conspiracy or otherwise, Sami Zayn has never been more successful than he has recently. Well, certainly uh, no one can question the in-ring ability of Sami Zayn, a multiple-time intercontinental champion. And somehow, for some reason, Sami Zayn still can't get a fair shake here in WWE. Yeah, sure, I can't. Introducing the challenger from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds. And introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 272 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez.
who's going to lay claim to the workhorse title here tonight. How quickly the tables have turned here on SmackDown as the Intercontinental Champion defends his title against his former mentor, Sami Zayn. I hate to say I told you so, but Sami Zayn has proven time and time again that he's only looking out for one superstar, and that's Sami Zayn. The IC champ should have just trusted his mentor. Am I the only one who thinks Sami's right here? Yes, Corey. Yes, you are. Draped over the top rope. Fly, are you kidding me? Incredible. Ah, oh, drop kick to the spine. Placing them into the corner. Such an incredible matchup. You, you get the sense he's willing to do whatever it takes to put this match in the books. Because I think the realization is beginning to creep in. He may have to do something spectacular. He may have to reach deep into his playbook to figure something out to earn a win. Oh, my God. Here it comes. Oh, my God. Knees, me. Uh-oh. Zayn looking helpless to every attack. Now we're seeing some rare flaws in Sami Zayn's game plan. Enough already. And Sami Zayn reverses it. Close With their head. The challenger not looking good right now. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Springboard misses the target. From the middle rope, breathtaking Hurricane Rana. Ah, running Hurricane Rana. Running Swanton finds the mark. to avoid any there. A continuous rush on Sami Zayn here. Yeah, a tough night so far for Sami. I think the crowd knows what we're about to see. Oh, spiked him. Looks like the champ is going to retain. Knee strike to the face. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation. from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sami Zayn! And introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 272 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. The Intercontinental Championship, one of the most prestigious titles in all of sports entertainment.
The Intercontinental Champion may be a week older, but he doesn't appear to be a week wiser after giving Sami Zayn yet another opportunity to compete for his IC title. Wisdom has certainly become a part of his story after Sami Zayn claimed his slow healing wisdom teeth held him back last week and his loss. All I'll say is this. It's nice to see both of these superstars finally at full strength and ready to compete for the Intercontinental Championship on the even playing field. Anticipated that. Stick to the score. We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. I don't care who you are, you can't take consecutive attacks like that without it affecting you. Uh oh, he's searching for something. Oh man, ladies and gentlemen, battle. Oh, and he's getting downward nastier and nastier with each of these attacks. He moves. And he's taking this to the outside now. Oh no, a sledgehammer. You better call him paramedics right now. Got it. Like that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. The challenger eating up some damage. He's heading back to the ring. He's got the answer for that one. Attack to the midsection. Counters. Looking wobbly in the corner. Up on the top rope. 
Has this part of town for these two competitors. This could go south in a hurry. Here we go. for something here, Corey. And whatever it is, it's not going to be pretty. Taking flight. Look out below. Just crashing down with high impact. Uh-oh. Clearing the table. Yeah, going to take it to the next level. What is this superstar thinking? They're thinking about the end. Finishing this thing off by any means necessary. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. And Sami Zayn reverses it. Oh, blow to the bread basket. The champ taking their share of hits now. Oh, taking a right to him. No waiting. Harsh forearm draped across the middle rope. And down! Zayn looking helpless to every attack. Now we've seen some rare flaws in Sami Zayn's game plan. Gets inside the ring. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Look at this! Oh, it just complete. Oops. And Sami dodges that one. That unraveled on Zayn. Time now to get his energy up and claw back into the fight. Oh, look at this. I don't want to be part of these problems. Don't want to be part of this crowd. He just isn't being given any room to recuperate. He's on his heels, that's for sure. Great counter. Momentum going back to Zayn's corner. But Zayn has the push now while the window's open. Oh, great. Now for something painful and tall. That's just hard to watch. Oh, and the ladder finds the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back from that one. Bam! That's one way to use a ladder. Saw that one coming. He climbs into the ring. Decision making there proved to be extremely detrimental. Can you recover from such an error? You have to wonder. And he has three reign to the outside with no time left to worry about. The champions need to finish the job. Sammy isn't going to like what's about to come his way. Good night. What a stunner. I think the champs got it. He's lining him up. Party's over. It's time to hit the lights. Now that is why they're the champ. Turn to the ring. Gets hit with an unintentional shot. Zayn looking helpless to every attack. Never seen some rare flaws in Sami Zayn's game plan. Oh, I might have just broken something. Now a pin for the championship. One, two. Oh, he kicked out at two. That sucked all the air out of this place. It looked like a done deal. Kidding me. Everyone here is in shock. A new 
strategy is needed right about now if that couldn't end things. And Sammy is countered. Intercontinental Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. And his victory is won for the record books. Sami Zayn just suffered another miscarriage of justice. Oh, that's a shame.